Hello, everybody! The rank series you have finally been asking for is finally here. I am so excited. Yes, I literally got an account to every single elo just for this game. If you guys want to skip to any of the games we're doing today, feel free to do so. We're starting off with iron. We have a silver, a bronze, gold, platinum, and diamond. All right, we're playing one game each. I'm going to talk about what you need to do in each one of these specific elos to get better at the game. And I can't get over how awesome this is actually going to be. I am so excited. That all being said, if you drop a fatty thumbs up on the video, I will do my best to do another one of these. All right, my ultimate goal is to do one of these a patch. Whoa, Zuri. Okay, we just got econ round one. Interesting. Interesting. That was a quick sell real fast. I didn't necessarily want to drop the Yasuo, but you know what? <clears throat> Here we are. All right? Here we are. And I'm literally just going to tell you guys how to play right now. Okay? Take the first chosen you get in iron and just play that team comp. <laughs> is, that, is that crazy for saying that? Too many people get inside their own head on what makes a good team comp and what doesn't. Don't overcomplicate it. Just pick the first chosen <clears throat> and work with it. <clears throat> okay? I legitimately think this is what you want to do at this elo. Alrighty? And this being said, let's think for a second. Hmm. <clears throat> we could level. Put another Maokai. He gets the brawler bonus. I like it. <clears throat> might as well. Might as well, might as well. Items super flexible here. This is good. But, <clears throat> Iron Game, our first game. Like I said, on the bottom of the YouTube bar or whatever. I separated every single elo. <clears throat> so you guys can just go ahead and skip to whatever the heck you want. Starting off with Iron. We literally just take your first chosen. We're sticking with it. We're going to make this as easy as possible and talk about... The basics that are going to help you level up and talk about all the things at which point in the game you need to be focusing on for which elo you're at, okay? Until you get from like gold, literally just get 50 econ, don't re-roll till you hit 50 gold, and then only roll after 50 gold, alright? I know it sounds crazy, sounds wild, but... It, it, it'll work. <laughs> I can guarantee you it will work. All right. Oh, gosh, dude. <clears throat> the anti fortune problems are trying to speak to us right now. How much gold do we have? 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Oof. Leveling up here. Selling everything and leveling up might have been pretty nice. Might have been pretty, pretty nice. Let's think for a sec. I think we're actually going to lose to this guy. Level 2 brand. Callista. Scary, scary stuff, baby. Scary, scary stuff. Anyways. We're just going to play it chill. <clears throat> Not overthink anything. Don't you dare press rend on me. Oh, he did. Yep. He did. Selling and leveling up, I would have liked a lot. But you know what? <clears throat> I also would have liked getting 20 econ this early as well. Heck yes. Heck yeah. Alright. We're just buying brawlers right now. Alright. We're buying we're buying brawlers and chilling. Big chilling. Sorry, Fortune. Let's not get too crazy. <laughs> we're not rocking the fortune. Even though it would be kind of cool to do so. Not gonna happen. <clears throat> Alrighty. And Pick your first chosen. Don't overcomplicate things with trying to see all the high level players do. Pivot super late game, rush eight, build a whole new team comp in two seconds. Just do not overthink it. Alright? And honestly, you could just force one team comp over and over and iron, no problem. Alright? So let's say I'm a brawler one trick pony. Well, that's kind of perfect scenario considering we got a brawler chosen. But. Hopefully you have an idea of, I would say just learn which different carries are. No, probably, it's probably too much in iron as well. Literally in iron, just get 50 gold, 
and then profit. <laughs> I really want to get a Sunfire on this guy. I do, I do. Let's rock with this. <clears throat> this Sunfire will set the tempo for the rest of the game a lot. Alrighty. Anything damage helps the Brawlers big time. Picking up that Shivana might have been worth just because... Uh, uh, brawlers are really reliant on getting Shivana, but this will be cute as well. Here you go, Maokai. Use it wise, use it well, my friend. Use it wise, use it well. Brawlers, we have gold. We are big, big chillin'. I like this right now. I like this a lot. Do we need anything? Nope. Got our Econ, we know our team comp, get above 50 gold is step one, okay? I'm gonna help you guys get out of literally every elo you're struggling with, easily, all right? I think these series, uh, you guys will absolutely enjoy because they're full sweat mode, full informative. And like I said, one every patch is my goal, a fatty thumbs up, I would appreciate it a lot. Alrighty. Oh lot, oh lot. Speaking of, do we want to level up anything right now or just keep rolling with Econ? If we can get 50 gold by Krugs, that'd be crazy. Crazy good, that is. Huh. <clears throat> I'm trying to think if there's another pair we can actually run, but nothing's really calling out our name right now. So, We'll keep selling, we'll keep chilling. This is good stuff for us. But, um, I would love, love, love to have some constructive criticism on this type of video. I'm putting something on my knuckle right now because it's all messed up, but constructive criticism on this type of video. This is definitely different from the norm. Having fun playing Fortune, doing crazy shenanigans. <laughs> but, um, I'm really excited for this series. Super mega excited, okay? And uh, like I said, if you want to skip to a game of way higher elo, feel free. This one ultimately should be pretty simple. And that's a wrap for the gold. Hello, hello. This guy has zero econ. What is he doing, dude? This guy has zero econ too. This is why I'm saying literally just get econ and you'll be very... Has that guy not even picked up his items? Does this guy know he can get items? <laughs> All right, let's not turn this into a roasting session. Let's just have some fun playing some TFT, and I'll show you guys how to play every single game, okay? And yes, it took a very, very long amount of time getting every champion to the proper elo to make all this happen. A lot of time, but it's totally gonna be worth it. Considering uh, doing a little patch rundown, so to say, in games like this is going to be so much fun. I cannot wait to go through it all. Let's see. BTIE. Not the biggest fans of these bad boys. Let's continue to chill. And we can honestly just keep saving up our gold. Brawlers kind of suck till we get one more. The re-rolling for Vi or Nunu here might be the move. Yeah, it probably is. I think we're just too weak if we don't. Too weak if we do not. Huh. I can see this being more damage from the back. So let's rock with it. Alright. Where's that Vi? Vigar when we need him, dude. Elderwood would be nice right now. I knew selling him would somehow turn into something bad. <laughs> but, <clears throat> more importantly, we have our gold. We are chilling. This guy is the rank one dude. He's snowballing. Does he have fortune in? Okay, no. It's just a warlord snowball. He'll fall off super late game, but... We'll be fine for now, for now, for now. Alrighty. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Decent team comp. Focus on levels. That's all it is. Let's get rid of all this junk. Okay. 
Irelia, I'm sorry, but you will not be joining us this evening. Do we dare do this? I think so, baby. I think so. Okay, mm positioning. Don't worry about that stuff too much. Literally, just get 50 gold. Find a good chosen that you like. And rock with it. Okay? <clears throat> I want to focus on the basics that iron players need to learn. If you're above iron, we can start to get a little bit more advanced. Okay? So we'll save that for the bronze, silver, gold, etc, etc. But, uh... Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Lots of stuff we need to worry on. Just only levels right now. Notice how that's all we're doing. All right. If we were taking a lot of damage, instead of leveling there, we would drop a few rerolls, see what we get, and play it out much slower. Okay. And honestly, that's better than the Katarina. Hello, hello, my friends. <clears throat> this little Elderwood shenanigans we got going on is looking pretty cool. Probably, uh, honestly, Vigor's not even that bad. <laughs> Keep getting spell power, buddy. You got this. You've got this. Hopefully we can land a tier 3 Maokai. We got pretty lucky with him so far. But I am very excited for this whole series. Oh my goodness. I can't get over how excited I am. All right? This has been a long time in the works. Every time you guys have said, Buns, you should do a ranked series. I've literally just been working on getting these accounts to where I want to get them for said series. Okay. Let's see. There's a bow out there. I do kind of want that. But if we don't get it, that's all good. Okay. We got the bow. <laughs> Dude, <it's not. laughs> the bottom two people are probably going to be AFK. One of them died already? Oh my god. Did he actually die? This guy's struggling. This guy's struggling. We got a assassin boy and a warlord snowballer. We got to worry about. Interesting. Very interesting. All right, let's drop this. Rock the hurricane, and I e. We'll wait on that bad boy, okay? But notice how we just pick brawlers and roll with it, all right? No overthinking. No other freaking random shenanigans. One more brawler would be nice. Yo, Vi, where you at? All right. Rolling at seven will be lovely. We can drop this other Maokai too, so... We're literally just going for levels right now. If I'm being totally honest. Just as slow and as steady as you can go. This Warlord guy, we're going to catch up to him. Getting a win off of him would be nice because he's making so much gold from his win streak right now. It's pretty ridiculous. So, let's see. 16 gold to level. We can afford that. We can afford that. We'll just put in Nunu. Our team comp's fine as is. I like this a lot. We got the diamond or this bad boy. I kind of like getting these guys, these two, into the fight earlier. So we're going to go with the diamond. But again, not going to focus too much on positioning for now. We have other things we're going to be worrying about. Okay. We could put in fortune, but we're not gonna. Go, Shivani, go. <clears throat> go, Shivani, go. Got Hurricane on Shivana. Actually, too juicy. This is the only guy I want to lose right now. It might be Smarfin, who knows? Let's see. I'm here to party, Kale. How you doing? Huh, dude, one more mouth guy. He's, this guy's calling our name right now, not gonna lie. Calling our name. The real question is, we're on a four win streak. Do we reroll for Vi so we can put in six brawlers so we become ex like a lot stronger? 
Or do we just keep focusing on levels? And focus on the set and the other dude. Oh! That is a spatula! Interesting, very interesting. Let's see. It's just wanting me to run fortune. That happens sometimes. When we play, that definitely happens. Let's find our, uh... Let's find our last brawler, shall we? I passed that Lulu, I'm so sorry. I apologize, I apologize. Dude, where is this last brawler? The scale's pretty useless for a comp, not gonna lie. <laughs> Alright, I say we just keep going late game. We have enough HP right now to keep going late game. So uh, let's just keep doing that. Works for us, works for us. Alrighty. And knowing what items work on what will help you a lot, but it's not like you need to know everything or else it's GG. Let's see. A Rage Blade would be nice for Shivana. Tankiness would be nice for Nunu. And this would also be nice for Nunu. Heztech, super core item with Brawlers. Good to know. And we'll just be going through so many different comps through this entire process. You guys will like it. I was thinking Morellos for Cho'Gath, but... Heztech and Shimana are your two carries when it comes to this team comp. I should just take out this kill and put Nunu, to be honest. <laughs> as silly as it sounds. And you can slow roll at 7 or 8 with Brawlers. Okay? 7 or 8. Remember those two numbers. Because that's when you have high chances of getting these tier threes. Oh my goodness. I mean, we're so ahead of the curb right now. It's ridiculous. I kind of like the idea of rushing eight to start getting the real champs we want. <clears throat> and we can also get rid of this. Hot diggity dog, baby. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Where's the Vi when you need her, dude? <laughs> Where the heck is the Vi when you need her? <clears throat> this mainly always reroll above 50 gold, and you should be pretty good to go. Okay. And in iron, the biggest thing is honestly just play a lot. If I'm being honest. Play a lot, that'll help a lot. <laughs> I don't know how else to put it. Huh, items wise, oh. God Fist would be coming pretty handy. Um, Rapid's always good, QSS is always good. The nice thing about this build, or this uh, team comp, is that it is pretty darn flexible. Let's go with a Hodge. Let's make our uh, Shivana a force to be reckoned with. I hate the fact that we had to grab a tier one unit on the carousel, but hey, if you can get the items you want, don't feel too bad for doing it. All right, Trap Claw, not so much. We'll be fishing for something else real soon. I don't actually care about this at all. We can sell you and sell you. I'm confident we're going to win this next round. So, 50 gold. Here we come, baby. Here we come. Alrighty. <clears throat> I cannot wait to climb the ladder with you guys. This is actually going to be awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Oh, go, Shivana, go. Go, Malkai, go. You're all donezo, you're all donezo. Other really good items for Nunu? Bramble Vest. Uh, Claw's super good. Hello, Cho'Gat. Let's rock the Nunu. Selricon. Six Brawlies in the building. So, we're actually going to be slow rolling at eight. And slow rolling 
means just start rolling. Alrighty. Let's see. Let's see, let's see. This is the Elderwood champ we wanted. Hello, hello. Bristle seems hungry today. Now we're just fishing for the Shivana and Nunu's. Once we get those, we'll be so good to go. I think we only have a tier one Shivana right now. That's probably why we're struggling. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. And Orn. Low-key kind of useless. Don't tell him I told you that. But hey, we're getting items. It's going to come in handy. All right. Morgana, don't care too much. I like the fortune we got going on. It's pretty cute. Pretty cute, pretty cute. This is the uh, extreme late game champion you want on in. The extreme late game champ you want on in. Let's think. We got a cute little Elderwood comp possibility as well. Let's see what items we get. Ooh. Double Hodge, count me in, my dudes. Count me in. We'll drop the Nunu. Or Lulu, sorry. There's more Nunus for us. Dunk Squad coming in hot. And we've got some juicy items to run. Banner, Spirit. We're good, we're good. Let's see. Let's put Cho'Gath up front. I like that a lot. Once we get a dub, we can swap out our Forchan. This Darius is useless. Or either Lee Sin or Zaya. Both real, real good. Go, Malkai, go. Double Hodge. In the back. This is beautiful. Did we really? Wow. We beat that dude once. And then have not ran into him since. That's wild. Okay, so. Now we're honestly just kind of fishing for this set. I mean, wow. <laughs> we still need this Vi as well. And hello, hello, baby. Oh, <laughs> wow. We got the dub. Let's do this. Let's do this, let's do this. Bye bye, Dare Barius. And we really just need this Vi. <laughs> How are we running into so much trouble? <laughs> Finding this Vi, I don't get it. I do not get it, I do not get it. <clears throat> we find a set before we do the Vi. Let's roll and see if we can find her. Eight brawlers right around the corner. And the Sigma money shall be leaving us soon. Oh, why wow, hello there. Um. Huh. Honestly. Didn't really want that item, but you know what? It is what it is. Let's see here. I don't want the pig anymore. That is lovely. Vi, where the heck are you? Alright, we're obviously fine without it right now, so I'm not too worried. Honestly, we could take out this Tom. For this Lee Sin, or for one of these. Just because Tom's not bumping us up a next tier. On our team comp, does that make sense? So, don't care too much about it right now, and it's already down to a 1v1. Oh my gosh. Listen here, uh, Warlord guy. We played against this dude once. Literally once. That's ridiculous. If he has Warlord... Uh, huh. You know what? That Vi... That Vi has no mana. I'm gonna make him take a year to get his ability off. An actual year. Let's do that. And let's do this. And I don't actually want to sell this Vi. That's the funny part. 
No siree, no siree. You rolled that. <clears throat> I like the spot we're in a lot. <clears throat> After Orn gets crafty with his items, then uh, sell them at good interval parts. Okay. Katarina, you're in big trouble. Dude, this series is going to be so much fun. So, so, so much fun. Notice how this game, we literally just took the first chosen we could, got above 50 gold, and now we're big chilling. We've just slow rolled over 50 gold ever since. There's honestly not much to it. All right, being for reals. Being for reals, being for reals. Once uh, Orn finishes this item, then we would put in Zaya for Orn just like that, but we are looking good for now. Positioning, don't worry about it too much. I'm happy we yoinked that guy's zillion. This guy's Katarina is afraid to jump into my... <laughs> afraid to jump into my frozen heart. I don't blame him. I don't blame him. We are strong as all heck, and this guy is bleeding right now. Bleeding big time. Dude, climbing the ranks is going to be so awesome. So, so awesome. Let's do this. Finding one more. Orn would be pretty cute. By the way, OP tactic for this. Check this out. Let's put in two separate Orns. Okay. Two separate Orns. Then watch what we do. Watch what the heck we do. They're both going to craft after this round. And then we're going to com combine them. And get the biggest bang for our buck you've ever seen in your life. I'm very, very excited. Orn, give us something good, not this random crap this time. Why don't you? Let's see here. Oh, thank you. Another item. Where's the Orn? I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for it. Alright. This is what we should run. And if that guy wants to do that, be my guest, baby. Be my guest. Alright. You can also put these items in on after the round just like that. Shroud. This Katarina is never going to R. Next to a frozen heart and got shrouded. <laughs> I feel bad for him. Wowzer. Okay. <clears throat> We're above 50 gold. No longer need this guy. We have our damage on in. We are big chilling. Nunu, where are you at, buddy? Let's knock this one out of the park. There you are. <clears throat> there you are. We can roll down now and have some fun. Just kidding. That's a wrap. <laughs> oh, that dude did not want to play against us. <laughs> For a few more rounds, going crazy with it. But, let's check out the elo. Let's see the uh, climb we got going in. Iron 3, moving on to bronze. Alrighty, I'm so excited. Let's let the ranked series climb continue. Here we go. We are moving on to bronze. I am so, oh, so excited, baby. So, pretty much same basics are going to apply if you guys skipped this game. Hello, if you uh, just watched the Iron Game. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. And I am so excited to talk about pretty much the same basics you're going to have to be learning from Iron and Bronze. Main things I want you guys to focus on are just playing the game a lot, getting more familiar with the champions, and getting above 50 gold. Literally, until you hit gold. Just getting above 50 gold is going to be the best move ever. Oh my god. Speaking of gold, we got a lot of it going on right now, and we may have a team comp that I like to run a lot. <laughs> you guys know how much I like to run this team comp because I play it a lot. So this might be one of those games. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Oh boy, oh boy. We have the gold. Let's buy out. Unless we actually get a gold, another gold drop, then we might consider selling for econ. Let's see. 
sell all this. We're at seven gold. Kind of want to hold on to this guy. So if we get three gold, we're selling everything. Alrighty. But I swear, iron and bronze games are literally just filled up with mobile players that... There, there, there's a lot of them. Okay. Um, something with bronze you can try to get more familiar with or uh, try to get better at getting used to. Knowing which items are good on which carries. Okay. I know that's a little easier said than done. But something to keep an eye out. Something to work on. Uh, in this case for us. Let's stay really flexible with our build real quick. We have a bow already, which is huge. Absolutely huge. So I'm trying to ask myself right now, how can we use this bow to our advantage? Okay. There's another Braum. We can get rid of this guy. Or another Tom, I should say. Dragon Soul. Don't necessarily want it too bad. I definitely should have pre-leveled. That's my bad on that one. Let's go ahead and level up. And hopefully we can knock this any other park. We actually don't have. We do not have. Another Vanguard. So we'll rock with this for now. We shall rock with this. Tristana, hold our items for us. Would you be oh so kind? Double Brawler, once we find Annie, we're getting sticky with it. And jiggy with it. But I am freaking excited <clears throat> to knock this one out of the park with you guys. We committed to the bow, or to the rapid fire. So knowing who does well with this item will make your life a whole lot easier. Okay? Well, you made him angry. Let's see. We have Warlord now. <clears throat> we have Warlord now if we actually want to swap on to it. With a Brawly as well. Interesting. Very interesting. We gotta level up big time if we actually want to rock with this though. The Spirit would be cute. <clears throat> but I don't think it's necessarily what we want. Oh my gosh. Holding on to the Katarina is very greedy for us. Let's see, six gold. Yeah, I think we're selling fellers. I think we're selling. Go, Tristana, go. Just focus on econ. Yeah, I'm gonna sound like a broken record. Okay? A lot of players, even when it comes to the higher elos, lose complete control of the basics. And I'm gonna do a little snowball action here. We have a two wins. If we double level, we keep econ, we put in a good unit, and we roll with it. Oh boy, I wish we had one more gold. We could buy this Tom Kush level two, that'd be nice, but we're big chilling. <clears throat> and once you know which items work with what, let's just pick a random comp. Shivana's decent with rapid fire. Kale and Olaf. Probably going to be our best two bets, okay? I wrote some notes on the side here because I want to go over so many different things with you guys this video. It is redonkulous, all right? I say we keep the, uh, you know what? Screw it. We'll keep Tom over Nilly. I think that's the, I think that's a mistake. <laughs> we should have kept the Nilly. Tier 2 Nilly is so good. Oh, so, oh, so good. We're last pick. So, um, <clears throat> forcing your team comps around, or er, yeah, forcing your team comps around items when you're last pick, not necessarily what you want to do, but I do know we have the main component to one of the main items for us. So what that means is, let's see here. What that means is. I just want to rush above everyone else in levels and try to get that champion early so we can run it. Okay. That being said, I believe, I believe we got a tier. Oh, this is good stuff. Ooh. Magnetic remover. 
or extra gold for us. Let's see, Garen could be a juicy warlord we could send on in, but I think we're going to care about this way, way, way more. We still don't have our chosen, and when it comes to playing strong, using a chosen definitely helps, I'll tell you that. <clears throat> so are we going to greed this or not? I like the idea of keeping a Hodge or Chalice of Power. Or maybe even Shiv, considering with a Rapid Fire, we're basically committing Kale, Olaf. Those are best too. So once you do things like this and have perfect items for people and the game's going well, focus a lot on EXP. And then once you do that, just go to the uh, first champ you get and rock with it. Oof, that is a cultist combo. Hello. This can definitely carry us throughout the early game big time. I definitely am thinking about running it. Hmm. The question is how, 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 how? This sounds pretty good if you ask me. Pretty, pretty good if you ask me, baby. Cultists will be some free tankiness for us. Don't mind if I do. Bye bye, Tristana. Running Nico over this warlord might be the way to go. Let's see. Or not Nico, but. Um, spirit. That's the word I was looking for. Okay, so we'll keep our eyes out for that. And I'm happy we have 30 econ. Your goal should be 30 econ pretty much every crowd round. Okay, need to write that down. Please do so. <laughs> okay, this might be a better cultist for us too. We get the Asson, Asson bonus. Asson. Oh, I like the brawlies here that we have. This is some good stuff here for sure. And. Speak of the devil. This bronze game would be perfect for a certain someone. Hello. I am making a ranked series that we just started. And we're currently in the portion where we help out new players get better at the game. <clears throat> that, that is you, yes. And hey, would you look at that? We got more of the items we want to give our Kale in the back. Oh gosh, I guess this would be committing to the Kale, not Olaf. That's an interesting one. Bada bing, bada boo. We lose our Warlord, but I'm going to say worth it. I'm going to say worth it. I'm going to say worth it. So... <clears throat> Do we rock with the QSS or not? That's the real question. I think we do. I think we do. I suppose we can keep it for a wee bit longer. But with Kale, might want to start collecting our divine champions. Oh, hello, hello. These are some fortune champions we're knocking out of the park, fellas. And uh, that might be something... I might want to look into a little bit more. Okay. But yes, Rapid Fire and QSS are the best two. You can literally just look up like any any meta team comp right now and roll with it pretty simply. Okay. But the Divine Champions we'll look for, we're going to get a lot of them at level 8. So just rushing there, then rolling with what we got. Honestly, I'm confident that we can force it because we are so far ahead of the game and we can make good supporting items with these. I'm feeling confident. Dude, Sivir in the back is nice with the rapid fire. Very nice quality of life shenanigans we got going on. Do we want to rock the Darius? Oh my god, dude. Swapping a 6 fortune would be so fun right now. I don't recommend you do that kind of stuff though. I do not recommend, as fun as it is, trust me, 
I know how fun it is. We are big chilling, okay? Huh. Not having our cultist is uh, making me a little sad right now. That's why we had the pike in the first place. But I don't want to lose out on the spirit bonus. Let's just do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. <clears throat> Works for us. And once we lose, we got a backup plan. Uh-oh. Rut row, uh-oh. This is not a good setup for us. Zed on our main carry. Pike, you missed the stun, you idiot. You imbecile. Let's drop this guy, and do we dare rock a fortune pivot? Oh boy, oh boy. Folks, I definitely don't recommend you try this. But we might try this. And honestly, you can keep whatever good chosen you have. Just at level 8 is mainly when you're going to want to look to pivot. Okay? That's when you're mainly going to want to look to pivot. So, here we're looking for Kale items. Rod and Bow. If that doesn't work out. Chalice of Power. Or... HP. Honestly, I think I want to get the HP now. Oof. Just kidding, never mind. MR, okay, we are just losing everything. Wow. Okay. That's wonderful. Um, screw it. We're gonna have tears for days. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> Actually, tears for days, okay? Here's a good Divine Champ we can run. Here's the Dragon Slayer O'Laughlin we were talking about. But we have a QSS, so it's honestly not so hot right now. But this is something we can definitely rock with. Three fortune on in. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's going down. It's going down. All right. Where's Kindred when you need one? Where the heck is Kindred when you need one? Thank you, Katarina. We're lost stricken. We have the HP to spare. It's pretty greedy to swap to a fortune here, but we're only doing it because we know we have this much HP and we have a massive addiction. Okay. You have to understand that as well. <laughs> We're going to be playing weak because we're going to be putting everything into gold right now. And then once we get a quick little cash out, that's when we go wild. I might even want to stabilize a bit considering we're not weak. We're extremely weak. All right, there's a difference. I think we still lose even if we level, if I'm being totally honest. Screw it. <clears throat> we'll do this to make us not as garbage. I definitely want to keep this Jax. But we're pretty much going to be selling everyone else for the most part. So... I would be okay saying goodbye. Ay, yeah, yeah. This guy has a Kale. I still don't want to swap out. Considering uh, his items are garbage. And... Yeah. I mean, I guess he could fix him later on with his magnetic, rem magnetic remover, but we'll see. We'll see, we'll see. We got a cute little streak going into this round. Running Keeper Kennen is lovely. But, um... Don't care too much about it right now. This is a cute little front line we got going on. <sighs> cute little front line. Oh, boy. <clears throat> this fortune payout may be a little harder to get than I thought. <laughs> Is it keeper cannon time or not, folks? Let's see what we get. That's one of my favorite team comps. We'll definitely run that down the road in a bit. Why, well, hello there. Sorry, Kennen. You snooze, you lose. Alright. Lots of divine champs we care about. 
Duelist, don't care about it too much. Alright, that little Jax. Believe it or not, that'll probably help us a lot. <laughs> we are struggling right now. Huh, Giant's Belt, BF, let's do this. Let's do this, let's do this. I'm going to show you guys how confident we actually are. With slam jamming down items. We have too many tiers that we even know what to do with right now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> too many. We even know what to do with them all. I think uh, an item we're going to really like is bow. Just because Shiv is super cool with this comp. Um, a Chalice of Power would be amazing. But... Our plan still is pretty much the same. Go level 8 and have some fun with it. Let's see. Warlord or Ruski. Cat's the only Warlord in here. We could try to get spicy and sl slide another one in, but... I think just one more Slayer Champion would probably be our best friend. One more Slayer Champion, but... We still have the HP... We're going to greet it up, and we're going to have some fun. Alrighty. If we can just get anything to make these tears come to life, that would be amazing. <laughs> Honestly, let's do this. Blue buff Lee Sin. Lee Sin can use that very well. Very, very well. Coming in hot, baby. Alright, I was kind of wanting to lose maybe one or two more rounds. But at least we're saving much more HP by getting this garbage fortune out of here even faster. Okay. Our chosen still don't have one. Now let's go level 8 and look for a real chosen. Okay. That's when you actually have the opportunity to get a real one. Okay, let's see here. You get out of here. You get the heck out of here. Enlightened Irelia? I mean, it wouldn't be bad. But it also wouldn't be good. And we can stabilize starting now. Alrighty. I should have uh, slipped in this Zed. That would have come in handy dandy big time. But... Executioner Divine is mainly what we're looking for. Let's resell, get some Econ. Slayer Darius, I mean it's cute, but... <clears throat> not necessarily what we're going for. When did we get this rod? Oh, we just got that on the payout, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. This Nunu's eating me alive. Ay, 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 you hate to see it. Anyways. Rerolling now, we're going to be getting a lot stronger, and we actually stabilized a bit just putting all that crap in right then and there. Okay? But that bow was mainly what we want. Did we win the 50-50? I don't think so. Oh, we did. Heck yes. <clears throat> Two bows for us. Very nice. Very, very nice. That Lee Sin would be pretty gravy. But, 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 we're going to pass on him for now, all right? Our team comp is looking so good for our Kale that we want. We're going to go ahead and try to find him some way, somehow. Okay. Rageblade, get in my belly. We can rock some Slayer for now, though. For now, for now, for now. This blue buff Lee Sin, I'm digging it, dude. I wish we could go back to the day where we could rock the uh, double whatever it's called. Oof. Spirit Yumi, it's good, but not great. It is good, but not great. Horn is interesting. Siphonar. Oh my goodness, dude. It is just giving us champs. That we could quite possibly run, but don't necessarily want to commit to. I see shark food. What do you guys think? <clears throat> do we put in the orn? 
Or not. Go, Broloff, go. Dude, that attack speed's ridiculous. Oh my gosh. I don't think we should. What is up with this guy, man? Wow, Zuri. Interesting, interesting. Level 2 Broloff. We might just have to commit to this at this point. I mean, I know we have perfect items for our boy over here. But, oh, jeez. Let's see. Well, Zeke's you for now. How do we roll with this? How do we roll with this? The fact that we still don't have our Chosen mixes everything up as well. Mixes and messes everything up as well. After Raptors, we're going to have to commit, alright? But ultimately, oh my gosh. I'm kind of sort of down with that. Why am I rerolling on a PV round? I don't know. I just got a little excited, okay? A little excited. But I really do want to take out the Slayer. <clears throat> I wanted to sell that as well. Ay ay ay. I'm going to hard commit to this Kale next round. I believe, I believe. That guy's only got tier 1. We're juicy, we're gravy. Hmm. Kind of like the locket in my pocket. <laughs> but we shall see. All right, Kale. There you are. Let's send it, baby. Let's send it. Let's send it. This Orn up front is interesting. Very, very interesting. Alright, lots of useless units. Let's get the heck rid of them. <clears throat> That's for you, my friend. That's for you. Frozen Heart. Ludens. Lock it. Frozen Heart. I think, uh... Lock it's going to be the way to go on this one. But, Team Comp's looking groovy. Last one I'm looking for is actually a little Kindred Action. We'll have Executioners for days. Oh my gosh, dude. If we can tier 3 this Zaya, that'd be nice. That'd be real nice. Also, we've somewhat stabilized, and by somewhat, I mean a lot. So, let's play a little more cool, calm, and collected, aka do this. Do this, do this. Here you go, Lee Sin. Do us proud, baby. <laughs> do us proud, do us proud. Finding one kill before other people do would actually be extremely nice. But, uh, my gosh, this QSS will do us wonders. Okay? Literally, in lower elos, how I said you just know what items go on what. You get those items, you'll gain elo. Like, I am confident you could force this team comp every single time and have extreme success with it. And I'm not just saying that. Oh, hello, hello. Oh my goodness. So, we want to take out this guy now as the most useless one. Let's think. Spirit's pretty cute. Spirit is pretty, pretty cute. I feel like this on Lee Sin is gonna be nuts. <sighs> go, Lee Sin, go. Dude, this guy's never gonna die. We can yoink this locket off him, too. And put in better things once we can as well. I love that. I love it, I love it, I love it. So, we have double spirit. <clears throat> I'm mainly looking for uh, Yumi right now to finish this bad boy off. 
Oh, what would be a sick item for Lee Sin? Oh my gosh, War Mogs, dude. It's on a tier one. I don't think anyone's going to grab it. No, 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 no. Oh my god, yes. Dude, that Lee Sin would be so crazy. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Dude, yes. Yes, 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 yes. I cannot wait. I cannot wait to see how the heck this looks. Honestly, we could put these items on Zaya too and watch her become a god. But I feel like they're going to be insanely good on Lee Sin as well. All right, we can sell you. Yoink those off of you. And my goodness, is that a combo and a half, dude. Wowzer. I love that. Um, let's see. Honestly, not so bad on Shen. This is a cute little setup we got going on here. Cute little setup. It really wants me to run this Orn again. But I'm gonna have to say I'll pass on that one. Oh, baby. Leveling up Kale will be nice. And I'm loving the execution we got going down right now, baby. <laughs> Lee Sin doesn't die. If we can tier 2 him, that would be amazing. Absolutely amazing. But, where's Yumi when you need her? Yumster, where are you at? Oh, hello. We could drop the spirit and rock a juicy adept in the back. I like this a lot. I like this setup a lot. We're well protected. <coughs> well everything. And we honestly are in a spot to go to 9 here. So that's something we can do. 4 Executioner, 3 Adept, 4 Divine. 2 Duelist. Oh my gosh. Comp's looking groovy. TLDR. Get these items on Kale if you're in bronze and profit. Alright. You will do extremely well with all of those. Okay. Honestly, this team comp... Uh, you'll do well with this at many elos. Many, many, many elos. Alright, who deserves the Sunfire? I'm leaning towards Yon, but honestly, you can make a case that all these guys do extremely well with it. Let's think, let's think. All I do know is leveling up is going to be juicy as well. We could just level up soon and pressure out this lobby <laughs> and be strong as all heck, which I do like a lot, but we'll see. Is it worth it? 48 gold. Yes, it is. Boom, 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 baby. Huh. All right, Yon. All right, let's see if we can uh, put in anything a wee bit better. Dude, I'm getting re-roll happy. Oh, my gosh. I re-rolled way too many times. That was I, I literally just got way too excited. <laughs> I actually just got too excited. Okay, you know what? I'm giving it to Yon, so he gets HP, and then his shield will give him even more HP. So the shield gets way, way bigger. But we can actually level up every single one of these units right now. That's hilarious. Waiting a round or two to reroll was definitely the move. But you know what? We're hard pressuring this lobby even more with the Mystic Spirit bonus we just received. We're dealing more damage. Oh, heck yeah, baby. Heck yeah, heck yeah. Let's see, if we reroll, we won't be able to buy either of these if we get them. So let's chill one more round. These guys are sweating right now. Big sweating. Okay. And who do we give the tier to? Who do you guys think? Shen. We'll hook it up with the Yumster. Alrighty. Next carousel, I wonder what we'll come up with. But my gosh, is this team comp beautiful or what? Wow. Big wow. Hitting that Yon just made me level on up. Dude, I think my favorite unit out of all of this 
is actually Lee Sin. Memes aside, this dude will never die. The Warmog Spirit Massage combo and a blue buff on him is so nasty. Aurelia is already tier 2, so we're not focusing on her. These are the champs we want. Two Zyas would actually be the cherry on top. These guys are duking it out. It's a battle over second right now, and they're going wild for it. Oh my gosh. I want to reroll. Oh, hello. Okay, we can't get Econ, so we're going to reroll again. Wish us luck. Dude, one Zaya away. Oh my gosh. I just want to reroll so badly. This is awesome. Okay. Um. Huh. What do we like? What do we like? I think, honestly, uh, we can come up with a little better formation here. I'll show you in a sec. I'll show you in a sec. All I know is this Vi is not going to be happy with this Lee Sin, dude. <laughs> bye bye to your main carry get some HP back look at it regen on up that is so freaking meme-tastic Vi just dealt so much damage these guys are struggling to stay alive right now they're doing literally whatever they can to, to do so mage don't need it GA would be cool bow huh kind of like the bow actually it'll reduce their MR by a lot you'll see what I'm talking about in a sec okay it's also on a tier 5 unit which is awesome check this out we'll sell you we'll sell you take that crit everything let's get a whole lot stronger starting now oh this is the one roll we can get Zaya Okay, well, we tried, folks. We tried. You know what? Screw it. Let's do this. Oh my gosh. If we hit a Zaya off that round, that would have been so freaking awesome. If this guy wins, he stays alive. This guy's beyond Dunzo, though. Beyond Dunzo. I'm obsessed with this Lee Sin. It could end this round. Kill your monster. He's dead. Is this guy dead too? I'm minus 20 this dude. So this guy definitely comes in second place if his team comp wins. Does he? Yes, he does. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's see if we can tear through this diet now, shall we? Let's see. Let's see. Well... That's no fun. Another FF. Bronze down. Dude, we're making everyone surrender. I love this. Silver next up. Let's see how we do. And let's see what you should do. And uh, let's also check out our ELO real quick. Just so you guys can appreciate how long it took me to get all these accounts to the right ELOs. My gosh. Next one. Here we go. Wow. Hello, everybody. Oh, wait. Whoops. I mean, uh, guys, we're moving on to silver. Let's have some fun. Let's make this work. This is what's going down, fellas. Okay, Silver, you can't just get 50 Econ and win every single game. I mean, you'll probably get top four, don't get me wrong. But let's not let's not get ahead of ourselves. <laughs> okay. We'll start talking more about uh, what possible options we can add in when it comes to playing these kind of games. And we can be flexible. I mean, do we dare run it back with the Brawlies? I mean, we probably could, if I'm being totally honest. <clears throat> we probably could. We probably could. Let's see what next item we get before we decide. If you can ever, if you can ever see your items before you uh, make commitments to these bad boys, that's extremely helpful. Oh, since we did, since we did get Nunu, let's go with the brawler. Sounds good to me. We got a little uh, Elderwood action going down as well up here. I like it. I like it. Brawlers for days, my dude. Wowzer. All right, pre-leveling here would be sick, but it's going to be a little tricky considering <clears throat> what we got going on right now. Okay. Elder would be nice. And honestly, if you can get like very easily thought out team comps, you can just go ahead and run them no problemo. I do kind of want to mix up the team comps for you guys considering... Uh, Getting like a different team comp every match or whatever would be pretty cute. 
But I can't pre-level, so let's buy something. Now we can level. <clears throat> but do we want to? I think so. I think so. Bye-bye, Zed. Oh, this is shmoney. <laughs> this is ridiculous. All right, so. <clears throat> Solid team cup. We're going to be winning out. We got to try to get this win streak going. And see where it leads us. Alrighty. I wonder if we just set Tom Cush in front. Everything else in the back. I kind of like putting in a unit up front that wants to get their ability off, though. So, like, I think Rakan could be a good fit. Because he'll just dash the back line, probably drop aggro, get his shield. So maybe we send him up front. Although Maokai with his slow on everyone is pretty awesome as well, and he's not going to be dying throughout the early game, so... Uh, maybe Maokai takes the cake. Let's think, let's think, let's think. One blade, one purpose. Here's a cute little cultist option. we got some duelist options over here. And random options over here as well. I think we'll just end up rocking with something else. Let's do this. The earlier Rakan and Nunu attack, the earlier they'll get their abilities off. I like it. We just gotta get Econ somehow. We can't because we spent so much gold on our champions right now. Pretty ridiculous, pretty ridiculous. <clears throat> hmm. We don't have good uh, items as well on what we're looking for. So that's why, instead of committing to the brawler here, getting ready for a pivot might be our best bet. <clears throat> Depending on what we get. Okay. These two items can go into a lot of different things. But we have our HP, win streak, whatever you want to call it, taken care of right now, considering we are looking good. Let's see. We'll drop all these guys. Since we're not fishing for a chosen right now, in my head, I'm trying to warrant out the early game chosen team comps that I can pivot to. Okay. So, Yasuo Fiora. We had two of each. So you'd think that'd be a pretty good start to go. But considering we already have our Chosen in and we're probably going to keep him for a little bit. Uh, we're not using him. Okay, something to keep in mind, something to think about. We need to kill this Garen before he spins to wins. Oh boy. Munch. <laughs> Yo, Maokai's nasty. <clears throat> Champion is ruthless. Alright, right now I'm just being above the econ limit while sitting on champions we could possibly pivot to. Okay. Something to worry about, something to keep in mind. If we can win streak till Krugs, that's the dream. <clears throat> and we have the board to do it, so I do want to focus on it. And we're last pick, so we gotta be even more flexible. Oof, that Nico. Super good comp we could possibly get into. Um let's see tier an elderwood comp we can mess around with let's see let's see we do want to go with the shivana route that would be the move all right interesting let's pick you up thank you it's a tier three unit too so pretty nice <clears throat> and pivoting over to vanguard mystic is somewhat sort of kind of an option oh boy here's the option for us do we send it or not I feel like we just keep playing it safe with what we got no need to be down. aka this and we can't get econ even if we sell everything 14 15 17 18 19 I take back what I said. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, we need a bow if we actually want to run Shivana though. And I hate passing up on this uh, <clears throat> Mystic Vanguard team comp, but I think it's going to be the move. 
We have to get econ. We're clearing everything we've got. All right, we'll probably decide. Uh, we'll see what Krugs give us and see if there's a clear path for us to go down. Right now, this is kind of screaming our name. We do need to get a Shivana somewhat soon, though, considering how important Shivana is to the Brawler family, though. All right, let's see. If you guys want to go a little above and beyond, this is more worry about it at later elos. But uh, see who you've played against. And if you want to just worry about quick win streaks like this, Notice how we haven't played second place guy. All right, you can check right here. Oh, we have. Have we played the third place? Yes, we have. Have we played fourth place? No. So I'm going to see what this guy has. I really want to kill this Diana as early as possible. Let's have her jump right into here right into our death pit people that are lower not going to carry too much or care too much about <clears throat> noon is the one that i wanted to hit this diana with because the munch is where the damage is at <clears throat> the big munch but 30 gold wind streaking up till krugs so good for us it gave us the early uh tier two recon and brawler and nunu so I say the biggest part that led to this win streak so far was the waiting to purchase in the PvE round till after the drops that we got were, okay? Just waiting till the end doesn't hurt, helps a lot, might as well, you know what I'm saying? Let's do all of this. And we have a keeper comp here as an option. But uh, I really hope we get a bow because sticking with brawlers very brainless, very easy, free way to climb. We'll see what happens, baby. We'll see what happens. What you got for us, fellas? <clears throat> Krugs, hook it up, baby. But. Tear. Hodge, not bad. BF, also not bad. 50 gold, I love it. Alright. We have lots of brawly brawly items. We could literally just commit to this right now. And if we do do this, I'm going to want to worry about a win streak a lot. So I'm going to spend some gold here to make it work. I don't want to spend too much, but... I really, really, really want to knock this Shivana out of the park. Alrighty. <clears throat> if it's going to give us the comp for free, I'm not going to say no. That's the thing. And you guys shouldn't either. We are looking good right now. Since we're looking so good... Now it's Econ City from here on out, baby. We are pressuring this lobby extremely hard right now, too, to uh, <laughs> step up their game. Because they're just going to take so much damage every single time they go against us. So, so much damage. Hello, Shivana. Welcome, welcome. I will welcome you with open arms to this team comp. We can hold on to you. Sure, sure, sure. Okay. Sunfire cape would be nice, would be cute. Morellos, honestly not bad. Even on, uh, I like Morellos on Cho'Gath a lot. I do, I do, I do, all right? But we mainly have our main items. The next main item is gonna be getting a Hurricane for Shivana. That's the next main item for sure. Okay. But on these brawlers, slow rolling at 8 is our dream. And I think we should be able to get there kind of easily. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Tier 2 in this Vi, Nunu, Shivana. Definitely our first priorities to begin with. Alrighty. 
But yeah, level 8 is actually going to be the absolute dream for us. Do we care about Vigar? Not really. We'll buy him because we might as well. We got nothing else to buy or spend our gold on. We can't level up. Keep 50 interest gold. We are making some monies right now. Alrighty. I really want to knock some win streaks out of people, so we're just getting the most gold possible. But <clears throat> I really don't think anyone's going to be threatening these two. So putting them close to the front, I like. I like, I like. Eat them on up, Nunu. Eat them on up. <laughs> Hedgetech keeps Nunu healthy, so he just keeps on munching. If you can get Brawler chosen, Shivana Nunu early. This is what this game's gonna look like. Alrighty. <coughs> it's extremely good early mid throughout. Late game, it falls off a tad if you don't have perfect items. So uh, we'll see what happens. That Jan is calling my name, dude. Any of these, any of these two, we desperately want, oh boy. Now we gotta think of what the heck else would we want. Alrighty. A Sunfire wouldn't be bad. We can work with either of these. Okay. Sunfire Cape would have been extremely good for now and probably would have continued our win streak even more. But, but, but. We need to work on items for Shivana because, like I said, come late game, this is going to be what we care about the most. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> interesting, very interesting. Do we care about any of this? I don't think so. 28 gold. Let's see here. I like spending gold here. <laughs> Even though it's going to kick into our econ bonus. Because we're going to have way better odds of getting the champs we actually want. We don't need any more Maokais, we need one more Tom Kench. Getting a Cho'Gath or the possible set and just better chances of Nunes and Shivanas matter a lot right now. So if I ever spend gold to go below the Econ route, or the uh, interest route, it's because it's probably going to give me way better chances of getting the units we actually want. All right. And we're holding random tier 3s because I want more of the ones we want in the shop Aruski. That's something we can use. Vi still level 1. What the heck you doing? <clears throat> Alright, free keeper bonus. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Alright, cute little team comp we got going on. A bow would be the actual dream. We can reforge down the road, and we're actually pretty flexible with our items, but we'll wait for that. We will wait for that. I'm hoping wolves will give us something we can use. Just something. Making Zaya an actual carry right now is actually pretty nice. Pretty, pretty nice, pretty nice. We can drop this for Khan. Any of these three champs, we get so much stronger. Roloff, no. Hello, Rakan. A slight chance we might actually tier 3 that thing. We'll see. If we level up one time, we can't really make our team comp better. It's just rolling at level 8 is much better than level 7. But if you are in a tough spot at this level, uh... Rerolling here is not bad. Not bad, not bad. What do we got? We don't need any more bows. <laughs> Thank you very much. <clears throat> Thank you very much. Honestly, buying this Olaf might have gotten us this Saya. Alright? It's like extremely... Like, you're dealing with the below the 1% type stuff. But if you guys want to go above and beyond to do that kind of stuff, by all means, go right ahead. We have a QSS as well for Shivana Mama. I think we commit to it. 
these items you cannot complain <clears throat> we'll guaranteed get our ult off and we'll guaranteed start spitting fire that's why qss is so solid like if this sigil money ulted it makes javana not attack anymore that would be no bueno for us that qss might have won us that round that's crazy <clears throat> That is crazy, that is crazy. Alrighty. We care about any of this. 32 gold. We could sell a lot to get gold. Like I said earlier, spending some gold to get better rolls is pretty freaking juicy. Alrighty, what do we care about? Dropping Rakan and uh, trying to reroll here might be worth as well, but this is fine too. This is fine too. What are we going to want to make with this? Honestly, Ionic Spark isn't too bad, but <clears throat> it is just feeding us our items right now. I cannot complain. This is definitely a team comp you should have under your belt. It's very easy to play. And it's very good, as you guys can see. As you guys can see. But um But um but um bum bum bum. Oh my gosh, I thought that was a floppity flippin' what's his face? Wow. This is like the Slayer Dream roll right here. My gosh. <laughs> Actually, the Slayer Dream roll. Let's make this fun. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Let's see. We can't go above Econ. I like that. I like that. I like that. Random Samira, have fun. <laughs> Let's see how much damage a random Shamira actually does. I think it's not that good. Yeah, we don't care too much about it. Tom Kench getting some damage in. There we go. We are putting so much pressure on this lobby right now. It's ridiculous, dude. They are just taking an ungodly amount of damage. <clears throat> like I said, all I can say... Please put this team comp in your arsenal. You will not be sorry. Oof. Set would be juicy items wise. Sunfire would be cute. Better items for uh, Zai would be really nice as well. I think actually a Zeke's might take the cake. Yep, it's going to be the Tom Cookie Kush. He's going to give us our level 2 Tom too. He's going to be chilling. <clears throat> chilling with the Zeeks. Nunu, Shivana, basically all your damage in this entire team comp. So, roll with it. Let's go backline mode now. Beautiful, beautiful. And alrighty. Since we're so in the lead, we can actually greed for some tier threes here. <clears throat> Super greed. But um I definitely should utilize our keepers a bit better. I'm wasting all this shield over here, so that's interesting. But go Malkai go. Frontlining uh, Cho'Gath would be my dream right now, but. Obviously, we don't have them. Tier 2 Nunu is what we really need. <clears throat> right now, Shivana's doing a lot of the heavy lifting. Which is fine, I suppose, but... Yeah. I really don't like the Samira either. <laughs> I do not. I do not. <clears throat> Let's see. Talon? No. Uh, it's slow roll city time. Like I said... The comp is 
pretty easy and basic to play. So let's rock with it. We could take out one of the brawlers if we really wanted to. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious. <clears throat> hmm. I wonder if Yone over Vi right now would be the move. I can see it not being bad. Ah, screw it. Screw it, screw it. We sold our Samir, right? Yep, that garbage is out of there. <laughs> this will be a slaughter. Lee Sin now. <clears throat> this is a champ that you just put in every single team comp. That's something I can get behind. We mainly just need this Nunu more than anything, though. That is all we mainly care about. Nunus and Shivanas. I don't want to reroll now because I like saving space. Just because sometimes these guys give you champions, not gold. And that stuff comes in handy dandy. Oh my gosh. Wow. <clears throat> Another Hodge, pretty crazy. Chalice of Power would be pretty cute to give both of these guys. Huh. Do we want a backup carry or not? Battle time. The adventure continues. <clears throat> Backup carry or not? I'm leaning towards a Hodge for the Zaya. I'm undecided. <laughs> They're both really good options, honestly. They're both really good items. Honestly, with Orn, we can probably turn Zaya into a carry down the road. So, let's do this. Let's do this, let's do this. There we go. There we go, there we go. Still want to level up this Nunu and Lee Sin, I'm so sorry. You know what, let's do this instead. <clears throat> let's do this instead. If we get an Elder Spat off the carousel, we could roll with that. But notice how chill this comp is, just slow roll at level 8 and do your thing wow that hodge helped a lot all right looks like we made the right choice I go where the trouble is looks like we made the right choice let's see zillion i'm sorry but you're not going to be in our team comp today my friend not today not today <clears throat> Level 2 Lee would be awesome. But uh, we're kind of fishing for set right now. Kinda, sorta, kinda. I'll sell this Vi if we have to. Or I'll probably drop the Zaya before we do that. If we lose this, I'll drop the Zaya. I really don't think we're going to be tier 3 in her. <laughs> but Orn giving us items? Count me in. Count me in, count me in. Oh, yes. Very nice, very nice. At which point do we roll down and have some fun? This guy took our set. That monster. Oh, decap set? Yes, please. <clears throat> That's probably the dream. Other carry items for Zaya sound pretty good, too. I am not surprised that went bye-bye, not even a little bit. Oh, tankiness for Nunu is awesome. 
but this will help get damage across the board as well. Bye bye to you. We could roll down a little bit. We're feeling frisky. Huh. Ooh, we get our item. Heck yes. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme, gimme. Interesting. <clears throat> Triforce Ruski, by all means, go right ahead. Like I said, I knew Zai was going to become a secondary carry because of the Ornn items. If we weren't getting any more items, the whole uh, Chalice of Power route might have been the move. I think that's the, diet, the guy who yoinked our set, so. Happy we bombed him. Let's try to knock this dude out this round. Hello, hello, my friend. Hello, hello, hello. The adventure continues. What do we need? What do we need? Oh. Bring the ruckus. Set hello. Hi. <laughs> Let's tier three this. And didn't hit it. Okay. Very nice. I didn't put in the. That's fine. No eight brawlers needed, folks. No eight brawlies needed. Also, did I put set in the back line? All right, it worked out fine. Let's see if we can deal 25 damage. Maybe? And okay. Well, we tried, folks. We tried. Now let's put in our eight brawler. This is the cherry on top. We'll finish off this item, then send it on in. All righty. We'll wait to reroll next round. And Sunfire will go handy dandy in our team comp. Oh my gosh. We can give another item to Nunu. Another item to Cho'Gath. And we'll see, we'll see. Let's see, let's see. I'm done in like 30 seconds. Here we go, there's the Sunfire. Here's the Cho'Gato. Oh, said he said, get in my belly, baby. Oh. Oh. That's real nice. Dude, let's three-star team comp and make it unbeatable, shall we? What are we looking for? Cho'Gath? No. Vi, sort of. Shivana. Oh my gosh. I just three-starred this set. <laughs> I can't believe we're one Shivana away. All right, there's the Vi. No Shivana needed. <clears throat> I think we're good to go. That's a wrap. 100 HP and silver. Let's see what the uh, ELO looks like. Like I said, if it gives you oranges, make orange juice. And promoted silver too. Not bad. All right, moving on to gold. Let's have some fun. That's a wrap for this one. Time for some gold action. All right, this is not going to be get 50 econ and get the free win, but sort of, kind of, we'll see. So the basics still apply. It's just uh, you want to have a little more tools in your belt, I guess would be the best way to put it. Okay. A little more tools in your belt. Speaking of tools, I said we drop the tryst and roll with everything else we've got. So that being said, um, like I said, basics still apply. Econing, just knowing how to play multiple other comps will be your best friend, okay? Oh my gosh. See, like, <clears throat> this is where we could run brawlers. And get away with it once again. <laughs> oh my gosh. I feel like we have to do it early game. I feel like we have to do it early game. Let's do this. Ay ay ay. <laughs> Here comes the pre-level. And we'll go on from there. I'll try to mix up the comps though. I don't want you guys seeing the same thing over and over again. But. <clears throat> early chosen. 
You best bet I'm taking it, baby. Pre-level, there we go. Um, oh my gosh, it just is begging me to run Forchano right now. This is kind of awkward, considering we're going to have a level 2 Tom. And we got to put in this guy, huh? We win, we can't buy Annie if we do buy this. Or Zed. Intro Sting, Intro Sting. We're going to say bye to these champs and rock this. Let's see, Last Whisper, Rage Blotto. Lots of good comps that I have yet to run with, with um, Last Whisper, so. <clears throat> we'll see what comes about with that, but. Malachi with the carry, baby. One more brawler would be the dream. And uh, yes, as you guys can see, brawlers can snowball pretty well throughout the early game. <laughs> pretty, pretty well. Let's see what other people we got so far. Scouting early doesn't mean much, but scouting somewhat early is good considering you can see what items people are slamming and more often than not, items can uh, determine what team comp you are going to want to go, okay? Hmm, it is cultist for days, sorta kinda. Sorta kinda, not really. This will probably make us the strongest for now. I actually do like Maokai up front, yeah, screw it. We'll do this. We'll do this. <clears throat> I wish we could put in some Slayer. Maybe this is the move. Maybe this is the move. We lose out on uh, Ninja and a free Brawler bonus for free. But I kind of like it. I kind of like it. <clears throat> I will not falter. These are actually perfect Kale items. So maybe rushing straight to that sounds pretty good. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Depending on what item we can get from here, will probably be our decider. Let's say bye bye to Brand and buy this so we can stay flexible. This goes into our Cultist with Vladimir. This goes into our Slayer with Pike. If you can't get Econ, get the most flexible of champs you possibly can. All right. And speaking of flexible, we got a little Slayer action going down right about now. I'm digging that. Huh. We could go more Brawlers. Because we have great items for uh, Giovanni here. But I think I'm just going to play the extremely flexible and most likely pivot come late game. Oh boy. This is uh, econ waiting to happen here. The thing is, this guy's rocking some Forchano himself. He has Shivana. Yeah, this guy might not be our friend. This guy might not be our friend. I'm gonna switch up the team comp though. <clears throat> Slayer with some, uh, hopefully, hopefully we can get in some fortune. Playing fortune when it's early on like this, not so shabby. If we can lose streak into Krugs, that'd be very nice. Um, We are no longer last pick. That bow would have been the dream for us. MR is actually not bad here either. Slam jam to QSS. I'm a fan. BF also good. BF it is. Hmm, that changes everything. What the heck do we want to do with these items? Like we said, we have good kill items. Um. We have pretty okay Samir items, but that's super late game stuff. And let's see here. I think we just say bye to the Nautilus. And the Slayer, mainly because I want to put in this Forchano. We could gamble right now and rock something else. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. We could gamble big time. Mm -hmm. 
big time, big time, and reroll and shoot for an Annie, but yeah, that'd be risking it a little too much if you ask me. Pike, just kill some of them, please. All right, but this loss is important. We need to keep the streak going, and if we can find any, we're in business, okay? We're in business. Kale, I think, actually uses uh, Nasus even late game, so. Let me see, let me see. Oh, hello, hello. We'll for sure lose this, baby. We will for sure lose this. Alrighty. Now, I think it was the Sivir comp that used that champion let me think uh definitely want to get econ here though definitely let's do it let's do it let's do it all right krugs are gonna decide our team comp <laughs> let's do that right now we have like i said really good silver items so let me think let me think let me think there's notes off the side on team comps that I want to play for you guys. Nope. Nasus wasn't in that one either. All right, anyways. All right, Krogies. Let's put together something, okay? We're set up for success to go late game right now. Because we're doing pretty well econ-wise. Huh. Do we drop the pike or not? Do we like this or not? Oh boy, I hope we can get gold off of that. I should have put in uh, this Malkai instead. If we don't get gold, I just screwed us over pretty bad. And by the way, this Janna Chosen, I might want to pick this up. Janna Chosen, very good to pick up. All right. Here's the plan, fellers. Here's the plan. I do actually want to commit to the Kalaruski. And here is our Slayer carry for now. All righty, all righty. Hmm. There's literally no spot for us to put this Janna in. That's hilarious. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. I actually really want to put her in. But, the Trinimir changed everything. Here goes nothing. We gotta keep the fortune. We'll lost streak for a bit longer. This will be cute. Spin, buddy, spin. Oh boy. Youchers. Youchers, ouchers. Let's pick up the fedora. I'm sure one duelist would be nice for us. Okay. But other than that, we're big chilling for now. Big chillin' for now. Huh. Ay, ay, ay. Dragon Soul, don't need it, don't want it. Zed, we could put it in for more Slayer, but not that important and we can make almost any item work right now okay we could use a bow rage blade we could use mr qss we could use um hp for zeke's and uh if you want to go kill you want to be doing pretty well econ wise because uh you want to be the first one to it is the thing you definitely want to be first one to it yo Trinimir I need you to do something now all right that was almost really good too bad it wasn't hmm 16 gold honestly if we didn't have a five loss streak right here I would spend some gold and put this together. But since we uh, do have a lost streak, I'm going to hold back and wait. Alrighty. 
We could actually make a pretty juicy Talon with this Morgana. And we could transition somewhat well because we have Pike. Oh boy, oh boy. Part of me wants to buy this Morg right now. But I don't think we're gonna, folks. I don't think we're gonna. The loss streak continues. This damage could be worse. Could be worse. Our econ's looking groovy right now. We just need to cash out so we can peace out. Uh, do we want the bow? How badly do we want the MR? Hmm. <clears throat> it's another spin to mirror. This is interesting. The MR was part of the move because it goes into QSS and um, Zeke's. But we got the long range in the back. Oh boy. I think we have to sell this Trindamir. Because there's no way. No way. We're going to be able to find another one. And if we commit to this Rage Blade. We are pretty much committing to. Uh, we're pretty much committing to Kale at this point. If we commit to the Rage Blade. Don't necessarily want to do it. But uh, Hurricane would be the uh, Slayer route. We could chill a bit longer. One Rage Blade on train isn't going to give him the most power. But when I get into this situation, I like to all in on EXP and roll down because we're such high level with all our gold and uh, look for a juicy payout. <clears throat> okay. Oh boy. Losing one more would have been kind of nice, but it's win streak time now, folks. It is win streak time. Ay, ay, ay. One more loss. Honestly, losing till Wolves would have been the absolute dream. What the heckity heck? Very interesting. Very, very interesting. Since we got that Trinity Mirror, we might be able to greet a little harder. Pluck them from their reverie. Pluck them from their reverie. <laughs> very, very, very interesting, baby. Hmm. Do we dare run a carry trend? That is risky business. Or maybe we go six Slayer. That could be cute. Let's think about this. Let's think about it. We have decent champs to send it on. Decent, decent champs. Let's see. Last Whisper plus GA on trend. A cute little warlord from who knows what. Literally, since we got these champs, we might actually just be able to pull it off. <clears throat> Last Whisper would be clutch. GA would be clutch. I'm not sure what the heck to do with this rod, though. Oh. We still don't have a Chosen 2. That could change everything. Rolling down at 8 is the dream, but 7 if you're struggling. Ooh. Intro sting. Okay. Here's the Slayer. Is Zed open right now? The thing is, I don't want to pivot to... Um, Oh, what do we call? Let's do this. And run this Trindomir. Instead of GA, I think I just want more damage. <laughs> I 
Just straight up damage. <clears throat> and yeah, instead of going for the Slayer here, I'm going to be focusing much, much more on something else. I love, I love how we're still rocking our three fortune. That's funny. All right, Olaf, then. Where are you at, buddy? Let's see. Dropping the Warlord isn't even... Or the Fortune isn't even going to help us that much right now. Cat's given us Warlord. Darius is given us... I mean, I suppose it's pretty useless for now. This is definitely a lot better. <laughs> but it's not... It's actually not that much better. It's not that much better. Hmm. I say we drop Darius for Samira. We could actually just keep Zed and rock the Sixth Slayer. Oh boy. We're going Greed Ball Nation right now. Greedy as all heck. Duelists, I am sorry, Trindamir. I am so sorry. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Bada bing, bada boo, baby boo. Hmm. One more duelist would be very nice. And we're definitely missing out on some tankiness right about now. Alright, let's think of some item holders for us. I kind of like the idea of Morellos on Pike. Holy guacashmole, I can't believe we're actually running a Trinimir carry. <laughs> I did not think this day would come. Do we care about Orn? It feels greedy. It feels very greedy. I think that bow might have been better. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Let's see here. Let's see, let's see. For Slayer Aruski, Olaf's normally the way to do it, but um, we'll see how this one goes. I might want to reforge this. Oh boy. I mean, the Jax was essentially pretty useless. And by pretty useless, I mean very useless. Oh my gosh. My big thing is we don't even get much stronger right now. I'm wanting to put in... Morgana very badly. <clears throat> let's think, let's think. Trinomir, you are a monster, my guy. Monster! We're greeting without the level up a wee bit more. I love it. Very nice, very nice. Hey, there's a kale we were looking at originally. <laughs> Dude, this orn is gonna bite me in the booty so badly. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, 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 ay. Yeah, we literally do not get stronger for spending 20 gold. Not even a little bit. Let's see. This will make us two, four, five, eight. We're going to greed one more round. Then Raptors, it might be Roll Down City. And if we want to reshop. If we want to reshop for. Our chosen look for like a chosen smear a super late game. I mean we probably should just roll at eight. We'll see. Their 
We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. I like how we're getting the free stacks now, Econ round. If you, if you can ever time an Orn around PvE round, do your best to do it. You're gonna love it, love it, love it. We're not gonna level up the Pike. We're chill there. Taking out these two for four duelists sounds like the move. Jax, Lee, Sin, Sunshine, something along those lines. Oh boy, oh boy. Executioner will pass. I do like that. I do like that. Jarvan will pass. Keeper, no. Huh. Could be an option. Screw it, let's do it. Let's do it, let's do it. Morgana, I believe in you. I believe, I believe. Bad news is we actually have to run Darius now. <laughs> I'm only doing the morgue because we actually have insanely good items for her. Like insanely good items. Thank you, Orn. Let's get out of here. Oh my gosh. The wears attacks and spells. Damage shred enemy magic resist by 40% for three seconds. Dude, armor and magic resist. This is gonna be nutty. She's gonna insta cast and it's gonna be ridiculous. Ridiculous. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this trend is slapping for true damage. I love it. Go, but I go. Holy heals as well. We might actually be able to greed to nine here. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Is there a sharpshooter we'd actually want to run? This will be a slaughter. I was thinking Azir plus Jarvan, but. That might not be the move. <laughs> I like the idea of this. <laughs> Morgana, get your ability off and send him to the Shadow Realm. So right now, Kalissa's our duelist. Something along the lines of Lee Sin as well as, huh. How do we want to finish this team comp off? I feel like that's all we got to think about. Jarvan, no. These guys, free level up. Hum, hum, hum. Lots of good items here. Last whisper, already have it. I'm leaning towards Hand of Justice. But you can't go wrong with the QSS as well. Alrighty. Pretty Hodge it is. I think maybe just... Last champion adding in Sivir might be the move for us. That actually sounds pretty cute. Pretty, pretty cute. Thank you, Samira, send it. <laughs> this solo frontline is actually crazy. Uh, a common six layer team comp is Tristana, Olaf, and Swain. Swain sharing Siphoner with Morg. That's good stuff, but we don't have it this game. 
And I'm confident we can go nine this game. I actually am. <clears throat> Confidente. Like I said, that Sivir actually sounds super nice right now. Trinomir, don't you dare die, buddy. Oh my gosh. Any CC destroys this guy. It is brutal. Maybe that QSS was the move. This is fatal. I might put up uh, some useless people up there with my... Like, we can int this person. This might be better. We get the pool down a little later, but should still be groovy. And we'll wait till Nexus mini round to all in. We're actually in a crazy spot right now. Crazy, crazy spot. Let's see. Which side do we want to be on? I think we beat this guy, so we're no problem there. We'll put Pike back right. If we can slow down this guy's attack speed with our Frozen Heart, that would be lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Dude, this guy's attacking so slow. <laughs> go, my friend, go. <clears throat> Uh-oh. Yes, dude, Jack stunned literally a second late. That Pike Frozen Heart actually won us that round. That was crazy. That was crazy. That was crazy. Oh my gosh. What? <laughs> Okay, this changes everything. Um, wow, I actually like the Callista here. If you can't utilize these items, you're basically screwed. You are basically screwed. Luckily, we can. Thank you for all the goodies. And it is go time, my friends. It is go time. I go where the trouble is. Hot diggity dog. Alright, you guys over there. I like that. And you guys over here. Wowzer. Scurry. Don't need the Darius anymore. We're good on that on that front. Honestly, I think we have to keep the Callista. I think we have to keep her. 17% health rend bops. Oh my gosh. Let's just get greedy and buy all the champs we've already got. Two comp going down. Alright, we'll buy the Darius. We'll buy the Darius. This is late game. Greed for whatever you've got. Hello, Trinomir. How you doing? How you doing? Oh. That's something we want. All right, we could drop a Nico on Samira, but saving it for Trind actually sounds very, very nice. Trind or Morgana. That's what I want to go for right now. Trind or Morgana. Worst case, we can just drop it on Samira and call it a day, but... <clears throat> For now, we're big chillin'. Darius actually low-key popped off that fight. Very nice, my guy. Very nice. You guys want to sell the Zed and buy a new one? Well, Samir's good. Olaf's good. The uh, These guys? Not so much. Now we just got a Nico chillin'. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I still care a lot about back right. Let's protect back left. I'm a little scared of this dude's talon. Oh, you dirty dog. <clears throat> you dirty dog. I really want to hit my frozen heart on him. 
Dude, Trin just keeps spinning all over the map. Don't get kicked. There we go. Yo, Trin's actually coming up. Big clutch. Big clutch. I should probably buy the Callistas. That dude's really close to getting a three star. Really, really close. Oh, Assassin Spat could be cute. Let's go with this guy. I'm actually curious how the Assassin would have been here. 25% crit strike and 10% critical strike chance. Or 25 crit damage. Oh, hello, hello. Don't need the Olaf. Oh my goodness. Actually, one more train and we have it. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Remaking Callista. Might have been nice, but we'll be chilling with this. If I can slow this Swain, that's all I care about. Go to the Swain, my friend. Go to the Swain. So does this champ suck with rapid fire because of the whole uh, ulti shenanigans? Oh no, she jumps right on top before she ults. It's kind of nice. That's real, real nice. Oh my gosh, he's out. This guy's 1 HP. Let's see how this goes. Let's see how this goes. Alrighty, did he tier 3? Oh, he did. Rut row. Yo, spin the mirror. Where you at, though? Alright. Nowhere to be found. Oh, he didn't move his Callista. I thought he did. It was a lease in, though. I'm happy I didn't move. He's getting slowed like crazy. That's a good pool. I love our comp. Yo, Pike just annihilated this guy. Wow. Pretty cool comp. Gave us Trinomir. We rolled with it. All right, that's gold. That's a wrap. Moving on to Plat. This should be fun. I'm loving the ranked series thus far. I hope you guys are as well. All right. Platinum. Here we come. Let's see what the heck we've got. All right. There's your gold game. Moving on to Plat. Very nice. Let's have some fun. Howdy ho, fellas. Time for some platinum gameplays. I'm so ready. So, <clears throat> when it comes to playing in plat, got another basics. Got to have a few more team comps under your belt. And you're good. <laughs> no, but honestly, uh, learning how to play with a poorly dealt hand will help you a lot. All right. Warlord need level one. You know what? Let's send it in Italy. Let's see what we got. And also, power spiking up when you get the chance. Okay? That is huge as well. I like the early Shivana. I think I want to keep her under my belt. I think I do. I think I do. Vi was who I was looking for as well. I like this. They're getting free wins as well, which is oh so nice. Alrighty, <clears throat> and a common thing you can do with Warlords is absolutely rush the living heck out of uh, a late game Champaruski you might want. Let's see here. Wow, we're one gold off of leveling up. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. Huh, Annie's cute and all. I probably should have snagged the pike though when we had the chance. Hmm, I'm down to roll with this for now. Okay, this guy's pretty strong. We should be groovy. <clears throat> Unless if this Fiora repels, reposts, whatever you call it. On. Okay, nice. We hit that. Very nice. Let's trim this down just a smidge. Music volumes all the way down. And we're big chilling. Do we pre level here? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Sell any level up so we can get more units. Better units, faster, give us that juicy tier 3. Bada bing, bada boo, can't use so well, but this we definitely can, let's see. Keeper, no, I really know. Hmm. Ristana might be our best bet with this, actually. 
I think we win no matter what. But... Oh. I can see this being stronger as well. <clears throat> I really like extreme early leveling with Warlord. So you can put a lot of Warlords in, and they can snowball with uh, other things as well. Oh, heck yes. Heck yes, heck yeah, baby. Go, Tristana, go. So strong, I love it. Okay, can we level again? Don't think so. But after this round, we might be able to. Even if we don't get champs, it's not that bad. Oh boy, okay, we got champions. Don't worry, we can still do this. Bang, bang. We'll put in Jarvan after we win. I think we have to buy this Garen, unfortunately. Because I really want to buy this Tristana as well. But we can say bye bye to this. We're just gonna use these items to level up with the sharpshooters, okay? So early on, it'll be Tristana. Mid game, it'll be Sivir. Come late game, it will be Samira. If we can find a Warlord spat as well, we will be so good to go, it won't even be funny. Alrighty. But let's find this Garon. And do what we do best. This Yasuo might actually beat us. Oh my gosh, he actually beat us. That kind of pisses me off. Since we're going to be focusing so much on levels. Oh god, our econ game is down the drain. This two tier two Yasuo, dude, he's strong. Wow. With healing as well, you hate to see it. Hey, at least we're not last pick anymore. We got that going for us. Anyone that gives gold will most likely be our best friend right now. Just because we're so behind in that category, it's redonkulous. Oof. Maybe grabbing uh, the QSS would have been the move. <clears throat> AKA this guy. This would be nice if we do find a spatula though. So there's pros and cons. Hindsight 2020 would be extremely nice here. But going back to the point of where our econ is completely shot. It's not looking too hot. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I don't even think we're going to lose streak. Because our team comp is so good right now. We literally just have to chill with no econ, which sucks a lot. All right, I was banking off making our gold through the win streak. But uh, yeah, that's no longer happening. Honestly, selling Shivana and putting in Garen here might have been the move. Just to get econ. I think that was the move. Oh boy, oh boy. If people don't go on Nidalee's side, we should win easy. Honestly, we have Tristana on the other side as well. <clears throat> we should be good to win out pretty hard from here. Uh, we don't care about getting tier 1s that much, so it's not like we have to buy them or anything. I'm just going to stand back this Yasuo, though. <laughs> We're going to steal his Yasuos. He's not our friend. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, if we did win this round... We would have been so set, considering we are in a spot to snowball big time starting soon. Alrighty. And this Teemo is something I actually care about. Alrighty, let's see here. Warlord Aruskis. It's honestly so dependent on... So dependent on getting the spatula. Otherwise, this Warlord Chosen won't do us the wonders it has a chance to... <clears throat> this guy's pissed. I'm stealing his Tristana. Alright, well. We can win out on everyone besides that one dude, apparently. I still want to put a high priority on getting levels quickly. And playing extremely strong. Going to level 6. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I feel like we have to sell the Shivana here. <clears throat> I feel like we have to. We're also one Katarina away from getting 
Way stronger. Way, way stronger. In terms of putting in our sixth fortune. Jarvan, I'm sorry I had to sell your duo. Listen. It was for the greater good. It was for the greater good. If we don't get gold, okay. Shivana, you're staying alive one more round. Not bad. A feast awaits. Which warlord do we like a lot? Up in the front line so we can slam jam this bad boy early. Huh. So, in plat, I want you to learn how to utilize spikes. We're 12 gold away from leveling. We're most likely going to win. We want high tier units. Leveling up here. And selling this guy if we have to. Sounds groovy to me. Let's see. Shroud, no. Trap cloth, no. <clears throat> I'm a big fan of the Sunfire. I feel like Jarvan will do a good job of spreading the Sunfire to lots of people. Considering he starts out here, burns a few people, then ports to the back line and gets burns in the back. <clears throat> There's our econ. Very, very nice. Wukong don't care. Tom Cookie will sit on it. Alrighty. But we're level six. The win streak's making us gold now. And oh boy, I hope we get another win. <laughs> this win is huge. But a lot of people have way better econ than us, interest wise. But uh dude, this guy is going crazy for his Yasuos. He probably probably pissed I stole his Yasuo once upon a time. He rolled down for it. Are you kidding me? Wow. He all in like crazy. That's nuts. That's actually nuts. Um, but yeah, this win super important. <clears throat> super super importante. I think it's worth to sell the Garen if we do lose, but hopefully it doesn't come to that. Yeet! Oh gosh. These Nidalee spears, not that long range right about now. Oh my gosh, we're in the clear. Dude, I swear, sharpshooter? It looks like you're gonna lose up until the very last second, my gosh. Wild, wild, wild. Okay, <clears throat> shooting up to level seven would be lovely. Oh my gosh. <sighs> That's a kale. Do we want the kale? I don't think we want the kale. But it would be pretty cute. Leveling up and putting in a little Dragon Soul bonus. <clears throat> Sounds pretty nice, but overkill at the same time. Wow, we could have literally spent all of our gold here. But end of the day, it would have cost so much gold. So, so much gold. Kill this Yasuo. Dude, Jarvan smurfed that fight. Literally knocked up everyone. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. <clears throat> we got the win. Kept a lot of gold from win streak and interest. We're continuing to snowball. If we get a spatula, it's game over. But I don't want to bank on that. Warlord's extremely good up until... Uh, Mega late game, unless if you hit the perfect Samira. So there's a chance we might have to go crazy and pivot off it like no other. But, we'll see what happens. I actually hope we get the Katarina. Okay, very nice. Very, very nice. Huh. Do we level and slam jam her on in or what? Like I said... Hyper leveling I go where the trouble is. with warlords is nice. Okay, we just got a lot stronger off doing that. And <clears throat> we could drop the Trist and put in the Severe. Let's do it. 
Let's do it, let's do it. Sivir, I believe in you. I believe, I believe. This guy's got quite the carry Tristan in the back. Does he win? Oh my god, he might win. Are you actually kidding me? Dude, I should have just slammed this stupid belt on the Shivana. I would have won that round. No. It's also extremely small things like that that are going to make and break the game. Oh my gosh. Literally giving this belt to Sivir. Or giving this glove to Sivir because she gets more crit damage with the more crit she has. And giving this belt to Shivana would have actually won us that round. Are you kidding me? That is ridiculous. Oh my goodness. I don't care too much now. Might want to put these items on someone else. But I can't get over that. That's wild. That's wild. That's wild. Dude, it might have been the difference for this round too. <laughs> So, so close. We had Econ anyways. Win streak doesn't matter at this point. Craziness. Craziness. Huh. Question. Do we sell our Garen for Econ now? Could be an option. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. <clears throat> um, let's see here. Let's see, let's see. Come on, Wolfies. Do us proud, I'm looking for the juicy Sameda Sunshine items. Okay. We actually have perfect Samira items, interesting. We could also rock the Sivir as well. We have multiple different pivot points we can move into. Alrighty. I'm down to commit to the last whisper script. Although uh, hand of justice would be pretty juicy. Here, let's do this. Sivir it is. If we get a lot of lucky sivers, I shall show them what it is. Uh, then maybe rocking with it will be the move. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Hmm. We don't have our Chosen in here. So that's kind of a hard pill to swallow. And Warlords, they're falling off a smidge. Not the craziest amount, just a smidge. Let me see what we like more. The Samira team comp? Or... Sivir. Definitely good items for both of those guys. And I kind of want to put in this uh, Morgana. Because we got a free Morellos to rock with it. Interesting, interesting. <clears throat> Let's think. Alrighty. I definitely want to rush to level 8. Then we can uh, rethink our entire team comp. And our Warlord's pretty tanky because of the wins we racked up. But... Swapping our entire team comp at level 8 might be the move for us. We gotta get there quickly now. <clears throat> if we can barely lose, that's probably the dream for us. Kill everyone besides Yasuo, that'd be great. And I think that's might be what's gonna happen. <laughs> Alright, good loss, lots of gold. Not much HP there. Not bad. Let's see. We're going to be... Ooh. We're neck and neck picking same time as this guy. We're going to still go into levels and chill for a bit longer. We're going to beep coming in hot and hum. Fortune. Don't want to run it. That guy's got Kale. That guy's got Olaf. This guy's got Executioner's. 
So the Samira and Sivir are both open. The Samira and Sivir are definitely both open. <clears throat> huh. We have perfect Sivir items so far. QSS or Rapid would be the dream to finish it off with. Ay ay ay. Oh. I actually don't mind losing that. It's one pick earlier before the carousel. Good loss by one champion again. And uh, this guy keeps his win streak though, so. He's racking in a lot of gold. That's kind of scary. Huh. Samira juicy. That Sivir's pretty juicy. That Katarina's good as well. I forgot we still have a BF sword. Maybe getting BFs is going to be the way to go then. Hot diggity dog. Okay. <clears throat> interesting. Very, very interesting. Looks like we're going to swap out of this Warlord team comp. And play strong starting now. Bye bye, warlords. Hello to all of you, my new friends. I shall show them what it is Fortune, please do not give me that. Interesting. Very interesting. We need tankiness. We need tankiness now. This actually works. Brawler, no. This. It's tankiness. It's one round before PvE. So I might want to chill just a bit. <clears throat> just a bit. Although one cultist would give us a free Galio. Screw it! Hmm. I don't think I actually like this, Swain. I don't think I do. The Sivir is a freaking damage beast. Huh. Yeah, Aatrox would help us with the whole tankiness aspect a lot. We mainly just need to level up our units, though. I like the Shen, and I like the Yon. Huh. Let's do this for now. Aatrox is kind of our dream right now, and leveling the Sivir is as well. Hmm. We're still flexible on items as well. Morello on you, not so bad. Any, any, anything to buff Sivir, pretty solid. But I like what we got going down. Ooh. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. Dragon Soul, no. Okay. <laughs> this works, this works.
Let's see here. I kind of want to drop the Shen, but that's our Mystic Bonus Aruski. The Spirit's pretty nice from Yumi as well. Huh. Ooh, this is interesting. This is interesting. We need to level up Sivir now. We're actually passing up a lot of good stuff. <clears throat> I really would be nice to finish it off with. But is that better than like a Samira final finish or what? Going level 9 might be over our head as well. Let's think. Maybe we need to play for the now. I'm trying to think. Huh. Our team comp's pretty flexible, pretty juicy. Let's see. If we drop Teemo. If we do want to go extremely late game. How many Aatrox are we up against, by the way? Not many, wow. All right, this setup will actually work. Actually work, actually work. Um, <clears throat> back to what I was saying. We could drop. Huh. Timo plus Yumi. No. This guy's got Sivir as well. He's looking for Samira though. Huh. I think rerolling for Sivir might be our best bet. Might be our best boot. If we just get one juicy fight, we'll be pretty good to go. Last Whisper, don't need it. Death Blade, good to go. Lock it in my pocket, might be nice. I was thinking actually an AP item. <clears throat> An AP item for Yon would be pretty sweet. But this Bramble is going to make us extremely tanky considering... Uh, considering we have lots of Mystic going down. I am the God Killer. We have... Lots of units that could get stronger right about now. I go where the trouble is. Give us some of them. Huh. Well, that's not what we wanted. Alright, do we hook up the Yone? I'm kind of leaning towards one of these fellas. One of these young fellas. Ooh. The GA is so nice going on Sivir. That is awesome. And these items are freaking damage. We get the armor pen. We get more armor pen. <laughs> Alright, kind of save till Raptors. Let's see here. How many Sivers are in the pool? Not too many if i'm being honest yes this guy already dropped his sivir she is open for business <clears throat> that's super good for us leveling up um 
Literally all the guys we have right now will help so much. So, so much. I need to keep an eye out for this Aatrox, though, because her pulling in Sivir, not what I want. Here it comes. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. ay ay ay. Yeah, better positioning can fix that, though. Maybe Yon can pop off. Sink. I don't think we're killing this Nico. Oh, -ho. not so bad. Yon did damage. If we level him up, maybe give him an AP item, that'd be juicy. We're actually pretty flexible on items. This Nexus minion round will come in handy dandy big time. But I like this setup a lot. <coughs> hmm. Titans, huh? Titans. Let's think, let's think. Ideally, we use this Nico on... Oh, wow. Rolling down might be the move. There's so many people alive and nobody has Sivir. So our odds of getting here are pretty high. <laughs> Alright, Yon. Here you go, buddy. Here you go. Oh boy. The Samira. Okay. Hmm. I feel like we're going all in at this point. If Sivir's safe, she does mad damage. Mad, mad damage. Oh boy. Dude, that was a freaking long round. Alright, we need to actually roll down now. Sup, Severe? How you doing? I don't think we go for that. I go where the trouble is. Boom, baby. Oh, getting that extra Sivir <laughs> was super nice, so we could use this on that. Thank you very, very much. I probably should have given some an attack speed to Zillion. But this Sivir now melts, dude. Actually melts. This dude is going to be so hard to take out. That's a tier 2 Samira. Wow. He's got double carries. That guy's strong. But that guy's out of there. Oh my gosh, it's going to be a close round versus that one dude. Let's see here. Olaf over there, he's got GA. Zillion in the way back over there. I really want to stun that guy. Let's do this. Let's do this. Two Yones, where are you at? Oh, we're playing against both of them. I like that. He moved his guy away from Sedge. That was nice. No! My Aatrox got pulled, but it actually wasn't to too bad of a spot. Oh my gosh. That guy's Samir is so strong. If we can just stay alive, that'd be juicy. Oh, one HP. 3 HP, not bad. Okay. Let's not get Aatrox yeeted out of there. And what does he want? He wants that. Gotcha. 
Uh, we have max Yon items. Honestly, whatever to make Olaf and Samira slow down. Just a smidge. Count me in on that. Bada bing, bada boo. We still have a level one piggy? Come on. Thank you. Yon, that's not going to fix anything. I fudged up my Sivir again, dude. I need her in the middle. I'm an idiot. It's going to pull her. Maybe it's not so bad. Oh, she got the GA. She got the GA. She got the GA, dude. Who knew a level 2 piggy would be so helpful? Uh-oh. That might hurt. Just kidding. We're good. All right. Aatrox didn't get that good of a pull off. Yon Mama's where you at? I mainly care about positioning right now, though. I can't have her in the stun, that's for sure. If Aatrox is there... Then I'll move Sivir... Or instead of moving Sivir... I'll move Zillion. Okay, we're safe from Aatrox. That's what I care about right now. He moved his dude way over there though. Oh yes, right into the middle. Go Sivir, go. You have to position so well if you don't have a QSS for random shenanigans like this. Sivir, revive, don't you dare ulti me. No, that's, oh my gosh. Dude, we just have to watch out for this Aatrox. Once he positions properly around it, we may be screwed. Okay. G the uh, Zill or what? Are you kidding me? No! That item is going to ruin our entire day. <laughs> I'll tell you that right now. <sighs> No, he got so much stronger. This thing is going to freaking stun us. Actually brutal. Actually, actually brutal. Alright. Yon, here we come. Is he looking for anyone? I will buy his units. No problemo. Okay, he's looking for Tristana. Interesting. Let's see. Alrighty. Alright, he moved Aatrox back. As long as his frozen heart is close to Samira, I like that. Yes, it's in range. Perfect. What? How did my Sivir get pulled? No zillion ult? That's scary. Oh my gosh, she didn't get it off. Dude, what a close match. Guys, roll with what you can. And do we win this? There's no way. Oof. So close, yet so far. All right, Platt's a lot of fun. Uh, roll with the punches. Let's move on to diamond, shall we? All right, get out of here. What elos we at? Not bad, not bad. Diamond, here we come. Sivir's a fun comp to play to rank up a whole lot. It's a fun one, and uh, here goes nothing. Hello, everybody. All right, no more Mr. Nice Guy. We're not playing around. Did we get that? No, we didn't. Okay, that's wonderful. That's, re that's really not wonderful. That was a joke. I did not mean that was actually wonderful. Here goes nothing. But we're moving on to diamond, baby. This is where we got to put all the peas in one pot. So we got to combine our skills and make it happen. Alrighty. What's something we can do that looks fun that we need to try on out? Let's see. We'll pick up this guy and the warlord for now. You guys may be thinking to yourself, buns, 
Why aren't you taking the fortune? Listen, I have sad news. In Diamond, fortune sucks. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, we're running fortune every game and only fortune. Ooh. Vanguard Garen. That's a Tristana. Huh. We have no Tristana items. But my gosh, am I tempted. I am very, very tempted. We have some pretty good champs for the Tristana comp. Only problem is we won't be running a lot of these guys for a while. Okay. This Braum we actually don't use for a while. And our items are not the best for this. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Um, yeah, last time I checked... <clears throat> Death cap doesn't go too well with this bad boy. Hmm, Pike, no. We could run the spirit. We could run the sharpshooter. Can we sell anything? Oh gosh. I feel like we're holding too many units that we want to run way down the road. I think we're just gonna have to get rid of these guys for econ, unfortunately. We'll run our cute little spirit comp at four. And chill. This guy's got Tristana in as well. My gosh. <laughs> but yeah, this comp is taking over right now. Absolutely taking over. Hello, Tristana. Hello, hello. Let's see. Six, seven, eight. Hmm. I don't want to get rid of the free kindred. I really don't. This could be another round we just take the L on. We'll see. Like I said, this is something we could do. I really think this will be our best bet of saving as much HP as possible. Oh boy, if we do not get a Tristana item, I think running this will be un doable if I say so myself bang bang go Tristana go honestly this is a good loss good loss for us if we can lose into Krugs that would be amazing alrighty but we need to get econ now econ now oh boy do we dare switch over to mage? I feel like it's too risky. Too risky five me. Oh boy. We could commit to this, fellas. We could commit to this. I'm trying to keep an eye on how many uh, Tristanas are out there. If we just get one chosen, we're in the clear, baby. Dragon Soul would really be the dream. Oh, no. Uh, honestly, that's not too good. <laughs> we kind of, sort of, kind of, sort of wanted to lose that. Garen. Oh, wow. That was close. All right. Hopefully, we can win a few of our games now. Holy hot dog. Dragon Soul Spat could come in handy, but we honestly need better Tristana items, a.k.a. a glove now. Now, 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 now. Like I said, a Dragon Soul Spat might have actually came in handy. Who got it? <clears throat> this guy, okay, he's not going to be using it for anything we care about. I wonder if I'm going to regret that or not. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. I wonder who we should have given it to. Thank you, Nidalee. Show him what you can do. We should probably commit to the Hodge now. 
<clears throat> Although, in order of items, Hodge is the last of the three when it comes to the Tristana items. QSS more important, Last Whisper more important. That's kind of why I want to wait till Krugs before we actually commit. <clears throat> but, oh boy, we'll see. This guy's got it too. Dude, my Tristana just juked that guy. Let's see. 16, 17. Selling that for Econ? Sounds good to me. Sorry, Siver. Econ at this point matters too much. And we're not putting Siver in for a minute, aka like one more round. <laughs> Alright. Tristana, Diana is what we want to roll for, but everyone else and their mom is rolling for him right now. So it's kind of hard to pull off. Mm. This sucks. We're not going to get 30 econ no matter what, and I'm not willing to sell Tristana for it. <clears throat> and getting an early tier 2 kindred is nice. So we definitely don't want to do that either. Wow, this dude's 100 HP. He's already level 5 though, so it's going to be hard for him to run this Trist comp if he actually wants to. We're staying low level doing it, so it's going to be nice. I don't think we win this one, but it is whatever. Oh. Ah, Kindred is about to smarf on him real quick. <clears throat> okay. Okay. No sell, we're waiting it on out, all right? Let's see here. We stay so low level with this comp, it's crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. There's a tiny, tiny chance we actually lose this. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yes, go for the Diana. Diana, if you shield, we're good. Uh oh. Stop giving me freaking rods. Oh gosh. Huh. Alright, no Tristana items. We might have to rethink our strategy, folks. We might have to rethink our strategy, baby. Hot diggity dog. Now that, uh... <clears throat> Fortune is in the mix. Who knows what we're gonna find. Who knows what we're gonna get. Kinda wanna run this Diana. We can take Tristana out of the equation. No items will pass. I got this. I got this. We're shooting for levels like crazy. It's giving us Tristana's like crazy too, wowzer. Hmm, I feel like we're gonna have to commit to some kind of AP comp considering how many bows they just, or how many rods they've given us. Only question is Jeweled Gauntlet or Morello. Morello's pretty good too. Hmm. Can we trust the Nidalee or what? There's literally only like one team comp. That runs death cap. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. We might have thought of something. 
Cultist seems a little open. Why does he give me fortune every single time? Why does it want to do this to us? Hot diggity dog. Sorry, Fortune. Not today, my friend. My addiction. We're going clean. Alright, finding this at least is going to be a doozy. Yo, this Nilly is freaking nasty, baby. All right, if we actually want to stick with cultist, we're going to need a bow now. Well, so much for that plan. Oh my God. These rods are pissing me off, dude. <clears throat> pissing me off. Cultist comp? Morgana would go with it somewhat okay. Somewhat okay. And we have another rod. That's the worst part about all this. Dude, stop. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Loaded dice. Interesting. Gunblade. Interesting. Huh. Alright, we just need to stabilize now. Well, let's go ahead and get our econ back. And... Do we go Deathcap Morgana? Oh, I feel like I like a carry Callista better. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Okay, we have one TF, one Elise. We gotta up those numbers. Tristan and Nate are doing all our damage. I'd hate to get rid of them until... We have more cultists. I go where the trouble is. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. TF, Siver, Pike. All right, we need to go to seven soon. This dude's got a few cultists. And they're pretty strong as well. Rut row. Who would be the best cultist to drop a loaded dice on? Probably Vladimir. Oh. Oh. That's a duelist. Alright, <clears throat> hopefully we don't lose these guys. That'd be uh, kind of sad. But, I'm probably going to be yoinking this rod off Aatrox. It sucks we have to waste it like that, but... It is what it is. Oh, baby. That's huge for us. There's the TF. Yes, please. Said your money, sorta, kinda. 
I really just want to get this TF leveled. There we go. Six cultists. There we are. We're one Elise away. Okay. We can start focusing on levels. You can take our death cap, or do we want to give it to Callista? Wow, this guy is such good items for Olaf. That dude's gonna be insane, or Samira, whatever he finds. Yikes. But yeah, we can finally focus on levels now, which is nice. <clears throat> and is Morgana really gonna be our carry? That's what we gotta find on out. Interesting, interesting. Hodge, no. Thieves Gloves, maybe. Hmm. We could make... Uh... <clears throat> Honestly, Jeweled Gauntlet would be insane on Morg. Maybe we just commit to the Jeweled Gauntlet to Rootski. I could see that being a thing. The good old cultist comp, baby. Yo, where's that last Elise when you need him? Also, one Sivir, one Callista off. We're so close to actually getting pretty freaking strong. Is it time to commit to it or what? 28 gold, let's do it. Random reroll. Okay, that was actually risky. I forgot we bought the blood. Um, let's see. Ludens, no. Has taco, no. It. <clears throat> this Morgana shall carry us. <clears throat> Don't think we want to load it now. And like I said, using it on who is going to be the move. Wow, that Morg is melting everyone. <laughs> Big, big damage. <clears throat> Siphoner is really good with Cultist because once Galio spawns, we actually have the chance to heal back up, which is super nice. <clears throat> I think we want this Callista if possible. Oh, wow, we wanted that Zillion. I forgot about Zillion. <laughs> All right, there goes the Callista. I think MR would be nice for us. Um, maybe just a five cost unit here is the way to go. Anything to buff Morgana too is good for us. <clears throat> BF don't really need it. Only thing I don't like is all of our damage is actually funneled into more. Let's see. These guys have the worst range ever, so we're chilling like this. Bye bye set. Zeke's here we go, baby. <clears throat> okay. Hodge, decent damage item for us. Not too shabby. We're just looking for one Elise, one Zillion, and a chosen cultist. <clears throat> and more Morganas. Yeah, loaded on Morg is actually going to be perfect. It's probably going to give us a lot of Nasuses, though. Holy kale. Those are some good, good items. Wow. Let's not mess with that guy. But loaded on Vlad soon. I would say at level 8 would probably be the dream. 
That's where things would get good. We might actually want to run four divine. Or four siphoner, sorry. Alright. After this wrapped around is when we're going to look to all in most likely. We're healthy, so... We can spare the gold as of right now. I low-key just want this one at least, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Come on now. Oh, we can melt you. That pool could have been a whole lot better. Ooh. Uh, Galio, you got this. Oh my gosh. Alright, if Olaf wasn't such a beast, we would have had that. Anyways. Not in a bad spot. Still a lot of HP. I like the Alelian soul. We'll pick up the Susan. <clears throat> oh god. Our bench is full. You know what? I'm going to keep one spot open on our bench. The option to get champions from PvE round is important. I should have wait. I should have uh, waited to buy that Nasus. That's my bad, that's my bad. So we're going to 8, loaded dice on Vlad, and hope for the best. Level 2 more would be sick. We might even tier 3 Vlad, honestly. There's that. Wow. Um, We don't need that at all. We don't need that at all. Loaded Vladimir. Alright, we need to level up Morgana now. Bristol seems hungry today. Oh gosh, these are all so bad. <clears throat> Dude, this guy's hogging the Morgana. Although our tier one more is doing work, he still hasn't found his proper champion yet. That sucks. Oh, lot. Ooh. We'll definitely take that. Zillion, where you at, baby? Honestly, all we need right now. That is all we need. Warlord, no. Assassin? I mean... No, there's no way we actually do it. There's no way... <clears throat> we actually do that. Wow, one more gauntlet and we actually get so much stronger too. Zillion more, baby. <clears throat> I might want to say goodbye to the pike. Wow, the level of champions we have is scary right now. <sighs> Believe it or not, I kind of like the TF in the back. I want to buy this Sivir. If anything, screw it. Let's do this. Oh! That is a money hit, dude. Gold is so important for us right now. Hitting that zillion was massive. <clears throat> Absolutely massive. Alrighty, our Galio just went god mode. If we can find one more uh, spatula in the carousel, that'd be sweet too. Obviously, it's not going to be here. We'll find it soon. Vanguard, honestly, even though we don't have Divine, I think we want the Morgue. As crazy as that sounds, even better than this crap. 
no divine, here we come. <laughs> it's literally just for the Morgana. Bramble vest, all that stuff would have been cute, but here we go. Oh boy. Where's a reforge when you need it? Hey, maybe we can find a BF and get another divine down the road. That's good. That's even better, baby. All right, do we like our morgue on that side or not? It ain't bad. It ain't bad. Okay, I think we're dropping the pikes and looking to tier three the heck out of any of these guys. Who wants random AD? <laughs> uh, I suppose Sivir. I feel like we might actually put better items on her later though. Pike, take it. <clears throat> take it, take it, take it. Oh gosh. Go Galio, go. Wow, he just one bopped that guy. Wait, my freaking Galio gets a GA? That is awesome. <laughs> uh oh, that's not awesome. That's not awesome. That is not awesome. Are you kidding me? Lee Sin? You're not about to do us dirty like that. No, Siri, I refuse. Okay, after this next minion round. Honestly, so many people are alive. If no one has cultists, now would be a decent time to roll down. Let's see. That guy has Sivir. This guy's got a lot of pikes. A lot of the bottom people don't have cultists, so... Hmm... I hope the people near the bottom survive. If there's a bunch of people alive, we'll have a lot of our champs in the pool. Go, Galio, go! I think we're good? Oh, we're definitely good. Thank you, Galio! Alright, we might actually make the Vlad too, we'll see. Oh yes, they barely live too. This is going to be the perfect time to roll down. If we can tier 3 any of these, we'll be in a sweet, sweet spot. Huh. What do you guys think? Do we sell... Morgana for Swain. I don't think we do. I really don't think we do. Oh, heck yes. It gave us a Callista that's huge. If we tier 3 Swain, we probably do. Oh god, we lost an Econ off that. That was my bad. Booyah, baby. I actually don't care about the Pike anymore at all. I don't know why I'm buying that. Aatrox, yes please. Vladimir. Oh my god, I freaking ball! I left a ball! I think I grabbed the Darius as I was piecing out, I don't know. Okay, any of these champs would do us wonders. Are we good? I think we're good. Dude, it is going to be a massacre this round. <laughs> it is going to be a massacre. Alright. Wow. Two top people lost. This lobby is ridiculous. Actually ridiculous. Where's Aatrox when you need him? Oh, hello, 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 hello. Pike, definitely don't need that anymore. Oh my gosh, we're so close, dude. <sighs> Screw it. We have to roll. Oh my gosh, there's a sever. The Oof. 
Hopefully we don't tier 3 Vlad anymore. That'd be sad. Any of these champs or Galio gets even stronger by a mile. This Kale scares the heck out of me, dude. She's one-shotting everything. Yo, Zill, ult this guy. Oh my god. What is that champion? Hopefully someone else can take him out. This guy's out of here. Don't need any of that. Look who's back. Give us the Sivir, baby. Alright, so we just played versus Kale Boy. We're versus one of these guys. That Kale's in the back over there. We're getting ready for this dude right here. We're getting ready, getting ready. Morgana's already in auto range. I love it. Lay down a W. Ooh, she got a pull down. She got a pull down. And Leeson's dead. Thank goodness. Ooh, okay. It's versus the hard guy. No chance we're letting this guy win right now. What does he need? Uh, can we take any items here? Alright, you know what? Sivir, you're about to carry this game for us. I was going to go with the Rot. But IE for Severe, I believe. Come on, baby. Do we dare put in Elise for another roll? There's no way. There's no way, no way. Oh boy, we gotta get this pool down ASAP, dude. Come on. Oh, that's a good pool. <clears throat> that's a pretty good launch. But this Kale does not mess around at all. Holy guacamole. Okay, we got to all in on our champs. Ooh. I like that. All right, even if we did hit it, we couldn't even buy this. <laughs> we could put in the pike and see if we go for a reroll. All right. TF. Int for the greater good. I believe, baby. I should have uh, zeeked my zillion on this side or this side. Hopefully it doesn't lose us the game. Morgana, you got this. No, did she really not get a single pull down? Oh my gosh. Guys, feel free to run cultist. It didn't quite pull in the dub for us. Kale, I hate you. Second place for the win. That's a wrap. If you guys are not subscribed, smack the button. And let me know if you guys want to see another one of these ranked series. That concludes Diamond. Thank you so much for watching. Peace, peace. We got to take a look. Peace on out. Alrighty. Uh, let me know which other comps you want to see me play or try to teach you guys. I don't know why it does this sometimes, but it does. All right. Peace, peace, peace. And uh, side note, that's a tier 3 kale. That makes a lot more sense. <laughs> Peace, guys.